to be honest, bro, I was I was on ESPN today, and this mm. uh, Adam Schefter report came out that they actually said you were doing PEDs. Oh yeah, that never happened. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 That was never there. Yeah. If you go skydiving. Yeah, yeah I was oh. about to say. Uh, yeah. 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 I was about to say. What not, part not, of not, I, not, I heard not, a couple not, of stories yeah. get me yeah. the whole yeah. time before yeah. the flight take off. One my parachute been this whole time. You ever play with yourself? Wait, hold on. <laughs> pause, <laughs> pause, pause, pause. <laughs> well, yo, are we rolling, Big O? We rolling, baby. We rolling? All right. Are we rolling? Well, welcome back to Lobster and Beer TV with Eddie Lacey, episode two. Two. We're at episode two. Episode two. How we feeling? Uh, oh, so this is the second one, and it's my second time doing the sober. Hey, let's. <laughs> woo, woo. That's a great start for me, guys. Yeah. Uh, there ain't gonna be too many of these sober. Ones. <laughs> it's a big thing because you said you you say you didn't like like being on the camera too much. It's like a thing. It's and, yeah. real awkward. Yeah. yeah, it's awkward. But you, you say make it awkward in your head. No, you're that not awkward. makes it awkward. Yeah, oh. You're not awkward. Oh, you got <laughs> that you, makes it awkward. You just, you just, you just I've got Dr. Al I've you. seen him perform, bro, and, and, you know, and he performs both ways. But you know the thing is, this is what I like to say, we have a helmet on and we're looking at the person in front of us trying to hit us. So yeah, we're not really true. like focused on like wherever a camera at and like yeah. the people that's staring at us. Yeah. But with that thing... Looking directly at you. It's just right there. It's like, <laughs> it's just right there. Like, it's on, you know? Like, <laughs> that's like my girlfriend's cat. Like, in the morning at like 5 a.m., it'll just stand on her chest and just stare at her, like, feed. That'll me. freak me out. Yeah, it's not cool. Yeah, cats are possessed, bro. Yeah. I was just finna say it's like some scary movie stuff. Yeah, no, thank you. No, thank you. Yeah, I pass on that, especially if it's a black cat. Oh, it's, on that. it's bad luck. There's yeah. actually two that live on the roof straight across here Seriously? from the studio. Yeah. Do people live in there? About uh, working uh, there? No, I don't think. I think that's abandoned right now. I think someone's just sitting on I the real estate. I wonder why. Yeah. That that says it all. That's the cats funny. own that spot. That's funny. As straight hell. up. But yeah, dude. Last episode was fun, man. We had Mark in town. Mm -hmm. get, get Main Lobster. Shout out, Big Mark. We uh we started working on the Eddie Lacy role. Oh, I got news today. What's up? Mark hit me up. He said his uh like chef is working on the R and D of the role and like getting all the ingredients. Like, Wait, what's R and D again for those? Yeah, who don't know. what is it? Hey, I, was, hey, I knew what hey, it was for, 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 for the guys, for, for was, the ladies and gentlemen. Research out there that don't and know. development. Research and development. There it is. There you go. <laughs> right when you asked that, my mind just went. Blank, that's why bro. I knew. You, that's why you pointed at me because I knew for a second you didn't. Yeah. Uh, you trying to stall. You're trying to see why I was spinning out. I, luckily, I, was I out. luckily was able to catch that <laughs> research and development. So that's happening right now. And we should, in like a week or so, get our first test box really? to try out, bro. Sheesh. I'm hyped. <sighs> Chef Eddie going to be in the kitchen. Dope. Chef Man. Eddie going to be in the kitchen. <laughs> yep. it's, only, it's only a matter of time. Yeah. Yeah. It's only a matter of time. I'm hyped, bro, because that was so good. Oh, legendary. Yeah. So he'll send it to us. We'll, we'll cook it up. See, mm -hmm. you know, we'll just basically say, like, we like this. We don't like this. We liked how this was packaged. We should We're going to do it, like, on camera? Uh, we'll, we'll like, we'll film it a bit. Yeah. Yeah, that'll be dope. Yeah. Yeah, it'll be dope. It's like, cause we want to capture the whole process, right? Mm -hmm. It's like, exactly. see, that's, a, that's the first time though. See, you're already getting used to it. You, you asked. Well, no, because like, be a game? Not, like, I was thinking of it from like, you know, y'all yeah. and then like the food, like I'm yeah. on the side yeah. of it. You know, like, <laughs> no. Like cameos, no. like I'm making an appearance here. Nah, we're going to have you preparing it. We, we should know. we should get <laughs> we should get you we should we should like get you like a straight like chef uniform. <laughs> like the hat too? Just yeah. totally vibed out, the, dude. Like yeah. the, the tall hat. Yeah. yeah. And, and like not not like a not an apron, but like one of the chef coats. Yeah. And it says like, like chef. And it's like chef and it's, it's yeah, it's got the embroidery. Like some uh and we'll Gordon Ramsay. Yes. Yeah. Like, okay. Straight up. And we'll yeah. only refer to you that whole time as chef. Yeah. If you get to demand a surround your chef, you're yeah. chef. Yeah. That's the only That'd way I might change my Instagram handle. Yeah. You can start yelling at us yeah. and shit. Nah. I have to you're, drink for that part. You're allowed you. to, chef. You're allowed to. You're allowed yeah. to yell. Yeah. Get out of my chef. kitchen. Well, I could be like chef from South Park. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Straight up. It'll be fire, though. I'm excited because 
it'll be fun too. We could mess with Mark too. We could we could just be like, yo, we don't like any of this. Well, the thing is that he will. But he, even if then we're like, ah, just kidding, he'll be like, no, something was wrong with it, and then he's gonna go and redo yeah. everything. Yeah, because the more times that we set, we tell him we we think it needs to be fixed, we just keep we getting, get more boxes. We keep getting free lobster R and D development. Let's make that. Wow. Let's make that. So let's wow. hey, hey, let's let's wow. extend this R and D. I should start it, off. You know? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Mark. How's it going today? And there's a whole bunch of stuff we don't like. I got a list. <laughs> yeah, I, this is what we need to do, Mark. <laughs> it's gonna get to the point too, where it's like you run out of things, everything's good. It's like you know what? Chips were not crunchy enough on this one. We're gonna need a whole fresh one to some new chips to test it out. Run it back. Run through everything. <laughs> I'm hyped to like work on the, uh, the like what he was saying, like the recipe too, having it like a like a play sheet. Or yeah, something. like uh, yeah, like football dope. plays yeah. and stuff. Yeah. yeah, which was actually pretty creative. Yeah, that was dope. Like the yeah, for that. that's he's, what he does. Yeah, he, yeah, he's such a creative man. Like obviously he's like a you know successful entrepreneur, mm. but like he himself like considers himself a storyteller more than you know a, a businessman and. I think that that's is the backbone of like why Get Main Lobster has been successful, and it's so dope. That's why I love working with the man because yeah. it's like it's the business stuff like it gets taken care of, but it's more about like the creative and kicking it and like that experience of us being in the kitchen, like him chefing stuff stuff up with you and testing stuff out. Like that's so much fun, yeah. man. Yeah, this whole experience. And he always cool. gets so excited too, and then that's when he starts spitting out ideas, and, and, then, yeah. and then nobody you, you'll be thinking for a second, you will react, and he'll be like, "No, nope, bad idea, bad idea." It's like, yeah. Yeah, I was just thinking about it for a second. Idea, if like if you like re, like freeze for a little, yeah, bit. we literally want to call the other day, and, and and he said one thing. It was like two seconds after, and I, I think we were both thinking about it, and he was like, "Okay, nope, bad idea." <laughs> Sheesh, on to the next thought. Yeah. yeah, that's how he rolls. Well, dude, you ever do drugs? Uh, have I? I don't think so. Yeah. No, I don't think I so. I, think- try, I tried an edible once or twice. Uh, But not nah, drink is more my thing. Yeah. yeah. I was thinking of that earlier when, when I was setting up everything. Yeah, you really came in hot. Yeah, no, no, I know. Like, there was no Jesus. warm ups. Like, uh, so, hey, Eddie, you ever you ever do P- uh, you ever do PEDs when you have to leave? Buddy? <laughs> give us give us the juice. You're, you got any other spray? So I gotta be honest, what? bro. I was I was on ESPN today, and this mm. uh, Adam Schefter report came out that they actually said you were doing PEDs. Oh yeah, that never happened. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. That, that, that was never there. I don't think I've ever failed a drug test. Actually, I don't have to think. I've never failed a drug test in my life. Yeah. Now, if they tested for alcohol for some reason, I probably wouldn't have made it as far as I did. <laughs> How many times did you actually get drug t- like uh, throughout the year? Did you? Oh, I have no idea. It's always was it a lot or not? Yeah. It wasn't that much for me. Not that. Not that often. Yeah. But, but was it, if, if you ever had a really, I heard occasionally if you have like a monster game like out of the blue, like that the next day they'll sometimes come and drug test. You, like uh, depending the, on who you are, yeah, yeah. that happens. Yeah. Yeah. Like, oh, for real? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, like if somebody like just balls completely out, they'll yeah. wake up the next morning with a note in their locker, um, <clears throat> take a drug test as soon as you get in, blah blah blah, and it's like for what. Like what did I do in these last four, four days or four nights to warrant me a drug test after a game? Like, yeah, but yeah, it happens. But not for me, no. Damn straight. Yeah, I would have been... failed anyway if they did. Who like what was the running back Ricky Williams? Yeah, he got in trouble for like we oh, continuously. Weed, right? <clears throat> he yeah, now has man. his own like he's like a heavy entrepreneur now. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He like has his own his whole whole weed company Uh-oh. and stuff, and yeah. he does all sorts of stuff. Yeah, he, yeah. Hey, what's up, dog? We got uh, this. This have you met Elliot before? Yeah, you met Elliot. I think like was it the first time? The first time I came. Barstool. Oh yeah, we were at Barstool uh, with Zay and. Uh, I probably yeah, I was about to say I probably don't remember if I was in Barstool. <laughs> <laughs> My memory of that is not there. <laughs> uh, Elliot's on our bowling team, and we have a uh, league tomorrow night. Mm. But he's about to have. Uh, his wife's about to have he's their not first yet. kid. Yeah, 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 he's not having it. He's not having it. <laughs> your first kid, congrats, yeah. congratulations. Yeah, yeah but he's he, your dry, You got your you got the money, bro. Got cash money. We got that drug deal going on right now on hey. the pod. <laughs> I like to watch. I'm Alan from Hangover. Yeah, yeah. well, no, dude, this bowling league is like old school. Like you, you, we have to pay cash every week. Cash, either, either, cash or you, check. That's you, it. You, you can write a check or you can pay cash. <laughs> Yeah, and then yeah. when the cash is out, it's like, they, they're like, we'll take yeah. your money next week. Yeah. <laughs> For real. I mean, also the people that run the league are like, 
probably 70 and 65 this years league, old. Bro, this bowling league's been around for 35 years. No way. Yeah, yeah. And, and there's like six or seven teams that all three to five players on the teams have been playing in the league for 35 years. Oh, yeah. Exactly. We're bowling, we, last week or two weeks ago, we were bowling against a couple ladies that were probably... 60? No. 70? No. 75 plus. Dang. They couldn't even throw the yeah. ball. No, they were old. The guy last week was... Literally That's what I mean, though. The two, with a little spin on it, and it was... But these two ladies, they couldn't. They didn't even move their arm back. They just went and they just and, dropped the ball. And, and the they ball were bowling just... nines and nine. And no I mean, way. Bro, they, railings up, or no railings? No railings. No, <laughs> no, no. So no. it was wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, yeah. We lost to them. <laughs> but, but it's also that's but, probably the part I would have kept to myself. But but no, because <laughs> the, the thing is though, it's it's what they call a handicap league. So everybody gets like like in golf, kind of. It's like where you they they take your average, and then you get a certain amount of pins before you even start. So we were down like seventy pins, and if you as long as you're hitting your average, it's hard to make up seventy pins right. in a game. So it's like. It was BS. Yeah. We stunk. We stunk, yeah. but it was BS. We're by far the youngest people in the league. Hands down. Yeah. yeah. It's all right. Uh, we still got points last week. Thank you, bro. It's good seeing you. Uh, let us know if the... If, We're on the clock. We're on the clock. <laughs> all right. We love you, dude. Let us know. You got your go, you got your go bag ready? Yeah. All right. You got everything ready. Congrats Bye. again. Peace, bro. We'll, we'll bowl hard for you tomorrow. Yeah, we'll bowl hard for you, 100%. Yeah. Later. Yeah. Biggie. He's actually... He's from Wisconsin. Oh, nice. Yeah. Hey. Loves the Packers. Jeez. Yeah. Loves the Packers. Wisconsin, yeah. that's a <laughs> interesting place. Oh, you so y'all need a third? <clears throat> you know, it's, bro. bro. No, I'm kidding. I, bro. <laughs> he cleared his you throat. Should, <laughs> you should clear his throat. You, I, you should bowl with us. Uh, that'd be funny. One, one day, yeah. For sure. I, well, I, again, it might be like now. It's I guess people would consider that like, an, I don't know. Like it's a sport of the, like not sport. It's a activity of the past. Mm -hmm. But bro, getting out there with the guys. Yeah. It's the it. best. Dude. It's so fun. It, it, Thursday nights now are my favorite night of the week, hands down. Just because it's like like there's five of us. It's me, Chase, Big Al, his dad, who's the nice. man. Yeah. He's the homie. You would love <laughs> him. Ridiculous. <laughs> you would love. It's him, just like 25 years older. Older. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and then and then Elliot. Yeah. And so, but the whole time it's like it takes three hours to bowl three games because you know there's five people playing on each mm -hmm. team. And uh, man, we just drink beers and kick it. And it's just the energy's good. The vibe is so. We're, high. we're the one. Like again, we're the one team. Of the, this is why probably the league loves us because my dad, especially, he's like the ultimate like great throw, great throw. Let's pick well, he reads because you know yeah. the names are on the screen, right? right? And so it says like Jerry's bowling over here. So after every roll, he goes, "Hey Jerry, great roll. Never met the guy before." <laughs> yeah. So he's but, talking to the other team. Yeah, yeah oh, his, his dad. Our team, the other team, bro. He's giving them nicknames. So, three, three yeah. oh <laughs> Like Jerry, yeah. that a boy. Man. <laughs> oh, it's amazing. So we just started following suit with him. And now the league loves us. Yeah, just yeah now all these old people are like, man, these people are cheering for us and we're taking all their money. This is, yeah. this is, this is awesome. <laughs> this is awesome. Yeah. So you, you'll have to cut like next season because, you know, he's about to be a dad. So mm -hmm. he, he said he's going to take next season off. So you, you might have to come in, bro. And okay. you don't have to be. You don't, you don't have to be good. Yeah. You don't have to be good because you get a handicap. You know so what I'm saying? It's just your yeah. average. So if you're, if you're, if you're bowling 100 consistently. Then your average, you you like I said, that's that's all you have to do is then it gives you. You want to hit, then yeah. you want to hit 105. I mean, that's all you got to do. Gotcha. So it's not like you're bowling yeah. uh, perfect. You don't have to bowl for a perfect game. That's what makes it fun. Because okay. again, we're not great bowl. I mean, we're decent, but we're not great. Yeah. So it makes it's a, it's a level playing Sounds field. Sounds no yeah, That's yeah, what I'm saying. Yeah. There's 70, 80 year old women that literally <laughs> can't throw the ball and are still and are still rolling yeah. it and doing good. For real. That should yeah. be cool to see actually. 70 some year old yeah there there's a lot of them having a the time of their life though i think that is that's the coolest part like they're that's what you know, i think man. they yeah. live for that i'm yeah. sure they live they that, yeah we live yeah. for it but they live for it oh they yeah survival for it yeah and, <laughs> and they, they always bring like a lot of them will bring like cards and stuff and they're playing cards while, they're, the doing, yeah, while they're doing it yeah while they're doing it and stuff that's dope. It's, oh yeah it's funny they're it's definitely super taking funny. peds too <laughs> oh, I mean, I'm, straight up, but not, they're legal in this league. Yeah, <laughs> they're, they're, they're not yeah. tested. Okay. They're not right. tested. <laughs> yeah, uh, I, might, I might dabble in it, then I'll see what's up. Yeah. You ever bowl? You bowl occasionally? Have you? Do I? Yeah, uh, I used to before I tore my pectoral. No, I still uh, kind of do. Yeah, but I probably have at least two games in me before my arm gets tired. Oh, for real? Yeah, it starts to hurt. So we will have to get you some like Toradol or something, and, uh, <laughs> and to get you through the to get you give, give me, yeah. to get you through the third game, we'll shoot you up before the yeah. game. <laughs> are you a, are you a righty? You're a righty. Yeah, I'm righty. Yeah, so mm -hmm. it's your right pectoral. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that would hurt. 
How's that work? So it was, you tore it and then... It like- uh, there's a window for surgery. Okay. And so during that window, I was in college at the time. Uh, like they put like a brace on it because like some people like they can tear it and like they can still go out and do whatever they have to do so they don't need the surgery. Sometimes when you tear it, some people can't, you know, function. Uh, so they have to get the surgery. Yeah. If you get a surgery, you're out for a year, then you come back, then you're normal. Well, I did it. I can't lift heavy like to today. Like I can't lift because there's really nothing there. Yeah. I can still play basketball and shoot and stuff, but like throwing, I can't like throw. Like if I throw a football, I'm pretty sure like 15, 20 yards is probably the furthest it can go before like it's like it's straining. But you can shoot hoops for a while. Yeah, I can shoot. Time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You I got- can do that. I can like pull. I can pull. Can you yeah. do push ups or no? Uh, like a little bit. Yeah. A little bit. Yeah. You got some game on the court? Uh, if we're playing horse, yeah. Yeah? I'm not like a red and dribble. <laughs> I can play defense too, though. I can play defense, yeah. 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 Oh, you would beast me in defense. <laughs> Damn. I, I play defense and pass the ball. Lay up yeah. here and there. Oh, right, so, but... so are you that guy in pickup that's like, you're like the guy who's playing defense? Yeah, I play defense. Yeah, but, like... <laughs> but normal, though. Yeah. Uh, I'm not like the, the your football yeah. player, basketball yeah. players. Yeah, yeah. That's like super rough and stuff. I, I hated yeah. that when yeah. I was in college and we used to play all the time. Did you guys right, go, like, to go to the wreck and play a lot and stuff? Mm-hmm. When you were, yeah. And yeah. were you guys just balling on people? Yeah. I'm assuming like yeah. balling on people. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'll be like, you see like some defense or offensive lineman are just slamming. I'm like, I don't think that's supposed to be like physically possible. Like y'all not supposed to be jumping yeah. that high. Yeah. But it was cool. Yeah. Well, was when I went to ASU, it was my freshman year. Or I was busy, man. I don't know one or the other. And we were playing ball at the wreck and a lot of the NFL. Vontez Perfect. Okay. Uh, would always go down there with a crew of football players. I know he played physical. Bro, not only did he play physical, <laughs> they looked, they, they got into a fight, a, a, a big fight. Every single time they were down there, yeah. and, and they didn't yeah. lose. I mean, Von I bet they didn't. <laughs> it's a yeah. bunch of again, it's, it's a bunch of me's essentially, even skinnier than I was. Yeah, you know, playing ball, and then all these guys, and, and yeah, yeah, Montez was. I mean, he was a beast on the court, but then if 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 you did anything to piss him off, boy, yeah. good, good luck, good luck. So you yeah. get down on a horse now? Yeah, I can play a horse now. Yeah, I'll take you. We can put a wager. I'm down. Uh, I've never even seen you play. You've never seen me play. Correct. I'm a lefty too. Are you a lefty? Not naturally. Like I write everything else. I do righty. Yeah. But like, yeah. But like J- JT and our other brother Scotty. You know, they're eight and ten years older than me. And for some reason, they like when I was younger, they would always play me in the basement, like on just like the little hoop. Mm-hmm. And I think just to spite them, I started shooting lefty. And then I just really stuck with it. Than them? I honestly, like, I can shoot righty now. And if I just started righty, I'd be a much better shooter, hands down. Because I'm a righty in everything else. But, uh, yeah. But you shoot left. I shoot lefty. Yeah. Okay, so what's the wager? Um, uh, let me think this. Something good. Yeah, it's gonna we're gonna we're gonna revisit this before. Uh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, it has be, to be yeah, we'll It'll be decided. Because usually I'm this I'm maturing. Usually I bet shots. <laughs> That's my thing. I'll be like, whoever loses gotta take five shots in a row. <laughs> Something like that. But or whoever loses has to buy the other like a bottle of tequila. Uh, if we can't think of another idea. Okay. If we can't think of another yeah. idea for sure. Yeah. I collapse on five shots in a row. I'm down though. That would that be just, <laughs> I, I'm super That's gonna be a se- I'm super that, I'm super competitive. That's perfect. Though. That'll be a segment on three or four. We'll, yeah. we'll I'll film it. Yeah. And then we'll that'll be part of that, that's part of the show. So that'll be how we start the show? Yeah. 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 It'll just be like a little side thing. Sheesh. Yeah, outside of the studio. We'll just get down on horse, bro. All right. I'm down. Yeah. All right. I'm, I'm down. honestly like literally my stomach is like I got the nerves now now that I'm thinking about <laughs> I'm just thinking about taking five shots. Yeah, it sucks. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it sucks. sucks. It's gonna hurt. And I'm smaller than you, so those hit yeah. me even harder, bro. Mm-hmm. But I, 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 sure I got to eat first. Yeah, yeah. Oh, one hundred percent. Eat before the horse. <laughs> I don't know though, because then if I don't eat and I'm like more in the zone in my game, then I'll beat you. And I, I mean, honestly, have to worry I should want to see you throw. I, I, I hope you win. Cause then so I, now it's like a give and take. Now I gotta be. I want to see you take five shots and throw up. That would be cool. I'm just not gonna lose, bro. Okay, well, just not gonna lose. Yeah. We'll see. We'll I'm see. too competitive. Do yeah. you do you have like a natural like competitive spirit? Like, like oh a, no, I'm always no. even chill. Yeah, even kill, not chill, even kill. Same thing. Yeah. Same thing. I get I I get into it, bro. I got into it this past weekend in my soccer game. 
I play <laughs> I play league on Sundays. Yeah. I get it. Even in bowling sometimes, man, I get these guys have to calm me down. Really? Yeah. And I'm like naturally like a chill dude. Yeah. But when it comes to sports, man, I just like and I think it comes from having two older brothers mm -hmm. that it was just always competitive and JT has always pushed me and we've always like battled on shit. Yeah. I have him, he was a great basketball player. But the last time we played, I beat him one on one. I think I remember you saying that. Mm. Yeah. So I don't think I'm ever going to play him again just that, so I can hold that's this. That's what one. I do my brother in Madden. <laughs> Literally, my oldest brother, like, he's way too good. So whenever I do win, like, I never play again. But yeah. it's probably like, I don't win a lot. I'm pretty sure I only beat him, like, three times. So he, is he a good... Are, are you, first of all, I guess, are you a good Madden player? Oh, I can hold my own. But that makes him probably a, a well, pretty... Well, no, he's like... He's, yeah, he's like upper, yeah, he's upper like, tier. He's got, like, when the game comes out, he takes a week off, and he just plays the game. Really? Oh, really? He learns everything about it, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's commitment. Yeah. That's Damn. super is he, commitment. Is he, like, playing people online and stuff, competing? Yeah, that's all he does is play online. And yeah. whatever, uh, what is it? Madden. Ultimate team? Madden, yeah, that ultimate team. I don't do none of that. Yeah. I just play with my friends and play online. Yeah. I keep it simple. He's into all the other stuff. Who's your team this year? Who you been playing with? Uh, Saints, Jets, and oh, Jesus Christ, who's this third team? The Saint, the Saints for sure though. Uh, Jets and it's a team with the why is Derek Carr your boy? Huh? No, he's so from New Orleans. Yeah, but I, I pick teams based off their their defense. So like linebackers, the Saints got um. Who's oh, linebacker? So he's good. He's good at That's that. right. I told, yeah, yeah, you're. Yeah. Huh. If you're picking yeah. teams off your linebackers, that means you, uh, you got yeah, game. I, but like, it's, it's just because that's the only pro, uh, player I control. Yeah, but again, it, see, Rook, so you know somebody's not that good if they're playing with a defensive lineman. Anybody who's controlling a linebacker, <laughs> yeah, I'm or going a for safety. those. I'm going for those. Yes, over yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but if you're playing with a linebacker or a safety, you know that they have skill in the game. Yeah. That is a fact. You ever play with yourself? Wait, hold on. <laughs> pause. 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 Uh, I've played as myself 100%. Yeah, yeah. 100%. Yeah, I yeah. yeah, bet, bro. That's, yeah. that's one you, of those did moments, you, Is that right? one of the games where you just, every single play, you're just handing that baby <laughs> off? Well, so. <laughs> that's wild. Like, honestly, I'm a passer. Okay. Like, I, I like to pass yeah. the ball. Like, I try to score as fast as I can. That's yeah. me. But. Yeah. I did like I run I keep it I keep it balanced if that makes yeah, sense. Yeah, do you actually like when again cuz you you know football. Are you kind of like thinking in the eye right, like this is what we're go this is what we would normally call in first and first down or in second and short or like are you like kind of calling it, are, do you Oh try, yeah, you yeah. have to do that. Yeah. yeah. So like if it's like a third and one, I'll yeah. probably line up in like a power formation and, and are you are you when you pick your it. plays are you like going by formation? Yeah. 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 Yeah, I know he's going to we play on one I mean, that's line. how you're that's supposed different. to go by for me. Agreed, agreed. I mean, some but, people like ask, what is it, ask yeah, Madden? Like yeah. ask the coach. Yeah, the yeah. And again, I know that I, I do like where it's like by play type kind of sometimes. Oh, so by I'll play go, type. I'll yes. go in there. But again, when you know, I'm looking at all these formations. I mean, I have some idea, but I'm like, ah. and then And then you got the, the play clock running. I'm like, I, I need 30 minutes to look <laughs> at this. I need, I need 30 minutes to find my play. <laughs> out of time. All right, we're, we're, we'll get down on Madden then too. Yeah. That's cool with me. On the pod. Mm -hmm. Because that's yeah. something I think that is going to become an ongoing thing here, and I, I'm, I, I'm to see if you're down the, for this the competitive thing. Is but yeah, yeah. well, I'm, listen, yeah. I'm about to hop in on that too. Yeah. But yeah. believe that, um, but but FIFA, <laughs> he's dirty in the. Oh, I'm, I'm learning that. Yeah. I just got it three days ago. Yeah, I haven't, even, I haven't played the last two years, but oh. I bet you I still. Uh, give, I st give me, give I'll, me like two weeks. I'll still put it where. <laughs> right. But I'm no, regardless, what, what, yeah. what we were thinking is is again like once a, like once a week we'll talk about a game. And then the following week, we'll play it and put it on the show. Okay. And so that we'll record us and we'll record the game. And then that'll be a segment on the show. Okay. It's good. Yeah. We're, we're so so we'll, we'll explore different games. I'm, I, you, so you play Madden. You've played FIFA. What other games have you been playing? Well, I, I just got FIFA. But you've played nephew, in the past. But... Yeah, no, 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 never. No, no. Oh, you're brand new to FIFA. Yeah. Oh, God. yeah. Oh. yeah. yeah you don't want this. I'm, I'm, three, I'm three days in. Well, I should say two because I was gonna play today, but uh, I wasn't feeling it. Okay, so Madden though. What other games? Uh, when I play Madden, uh, Spider Man. Ooh. Well, Madden's the only sports game I play. Well, yeah. except for FIFA. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So yeah, so what uh, other not non sports games even? Uh, yeah. Spider Man, Call of Duty, Fortnite. God of War. Mm. So you like the shooters? Yeah. Are you like? Do you still play Fortnite? Yeah. Are you dirty? No. 
Do you do? You, you, you build? You're, you're not flipping nineties, oh, man, or what? I don't, I don't even. I don't even play build. Like, that's, it's so yeah, pointless. Like I'm crazy. trying to shoot you. I don't want you to go way yeah. up there. Like, that's crazy. I, there's nothing yeah. I can do about that. We'll have to run one v ones in that. In Fortnite, I'll crank nineties on all you guys, and I'm not even good, but I can crank them. <laughs> I, got, I got no game in Fortnite. Warzone, I get down. Yeah, yeah. Warzone. Warzone. Yeah, yeah, I hit so you up the other night. You were playing Warzone. I'm getting Warzone. better at yeah. that. Uh, I played today a little bit. Um, this is way more fast paced, though. Yeah, it's yeah, way more fast. -paced. I like that. I've been liking the resurgence instead of did, just. Did a you do it today yet? Battle Royale. No, no. Is it new? Yeah. Well, so my friend told me that they had it two years ago, but they I guess they just added it again yesterday or earlier this morning. <laughs> And uh, I played it today. It's like a smaller map, and like everything is like super fast. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So I did that today, and um, I don't think I cracked 50th place. No. Were no. you playing solos? Yeah, solo by myself. Yeah. Yeah. It's fine with the team. It's like as soon as I land, I just die. I'm like, how did y'all get out your gun source? Like we literally jump. Yeah, because the you're at the playing against some seven year old who's literally on crack. <laughs> like, how and, did they get to the and, ground first? Though? I'm trying to get there too. Because they and, got strategy. Well, and, the, and the PC players, like if you're uh, playing cross, turn off cross play. Turn off yeah, cross play. Yeah, you got to turn off cross play in okay. the settings. We'll we'll get down. We'll I'll yeah. get your tag. I'm gotcha. surprised we haven't done this yet. Right. But yeah, we'll get down on Warzone. I'm I'm okay. That's my that's literally the one game I play. I I've been off FIFA for a minute. Too. Me too. Was there any? But like so okay. So you got a couple of shooters. Any of the older games? Like when you were growing up, did you play? You were outside. You, I think we were talking about. Yeah, I'm, outside, I'm outside. Did you play any like Mario's or any of that stuff? Yeah, I played. Uh, what? Let's go back. Nintendo 64. Yeah. Double O Seven. Oh. Uh, Golden Eye. Yeah. Golden Eye. Yeah. Yeah. Golden Eye. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, the best, brother. The theme music for that one is iconic. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Play with odd job. Um, yeah. The little short guy. Yeah. He was, that's cheating. It's that's cheating, cheating 100%. That's what my middle brother would use. <laughs> oh, yeah. He used job every time. But um, yeah, that. Um, Cruising USA. That was a race car game. Mm -hmm. um, was it Madden? Madden 64? That's how I learned yeah, most yeah. of my football players because of the football. That's how I learned all my football players, actually. Oh, for real? That's how I Back then, it was too. because of the video game. Um, but like Mario all Party. Of, all of Mario Parties. Yeah, Mar all of yes, Mario Parties. My favorite. All of them, yeah. I never got down on Mario oh, Party. Oh, my what? bro. I played a few it's times. It's so good. Yeah, but, that, dude, the, it's, again, the mini games. The mini, bro, that's are, where it's yeah, at. That is it's a, that's that's where it's Oh, at. dude, they're so good. Yes, they're yes. so fun. And then, like, on that one, too, you can do just, like, mini games, even. So, if you didn't want to play the thing. And, bro, yeah. there's, dude, they're so. Oh, man. You're going to have to figure out how to get him on that. Yeah, no, we're, yeah. I'm down. Yeah. I have a 64 still. You do? Do you? Mm -hmm. Oh, we'll have to That's set that up. Yeah, yeah. No, I have yeah 64 I'll, still. Game over. Yeah. 64. So I got, but Mario Kart, Mario, Mario Kart, Kart yeah. yeah, Mario Kart, Mario Party. Did you ever do 10, 1080 snowboarding? Oh yes, yeah, so we got that too. On 64. 1080 snowboarding, absolutely. Yeah, and then uh, Mario Tennis. Mario Tennis was. Bro, I know. Yeah, was, I played that a few times. That might have been yeah. a white thing, you know, or whatever. But that was, <laughs> that was, that was, that was bro, that game is awesome. Oh, it shit. is, it is so fun. It is really it? is because it takes skill. It's, it's yeah. just like you know, it's, it's just fun trolling around it. That and then uh, it's like it must be a white thing. <laughs> that and then uh, I don't know if they had it for that, but when the GameCube came out. They came out with Mario Strikers, which was soccer. Yeah. And that was also a really good game. Oh, I played that. I, I have every system that, pretty yeah. much still. Do you? Every single one. But from, from the NES, from the, so the original Nintendo. Mm -hmm. I don't have like the Sega. I got the original Nintendo, Super Nintendo. Sega. Yeah. Super, mm. Super Nintendo. Supersonic. N64, GameCube, PlayStation 2, Wii, PlayStation 4, and this dude's just like a walking GameStop. Seriously, I am. Like that was <laughs> next part of his crib. Yeah, yeah straight up. <laughs> no, you just gotta bring them all here. Yeah, yeah no. Are they? I have to, no, yeah. the, the, the kicker is In I actually. Office. So I don't keep most of them at my house. We can only rent one out from my mom's house at a time. Rent. Yeah, literally. <laughs> it's, a Chicago, <laughs> I mean, it's a free rental, but we can only have one at a time. Because like, I mean, they were that bought us. All. My mom actually was the gamer. Like that's how. Like really, my mom was like oh, for a real? big time gamer. Wow. Like for uh, Super Nintendo and stuff. And she used to sit there with her her sister on the phone to like th three in the morning playing like you know Mario, Zelda, like all no those way. things. She used to yeah. sit there with like and bottle feed us. With like us in her lap, that's and, and she, and that's she a move. my that's dad, that's my cool dad mom. never played video games ever, but my mom always did. So then yeah. she always like they always got us every system as they came out and stuff, and we all share it as like my with my other two brothers. 
Um, but yeah, because now they're valuable and stuff, and nobody has the systems, and mm-hmm. they've had so many games yeah. that we can. She like she's a one at a time. You can only find out one at a time. That. I get it. Now I understand why it's a rental. Yeah. I get it. Yeah. Yeah. She, that she's still on yeah. that. Yeah. Yeah. She's like, I want it. You're not finna lose none of my stuff. Oh hell no. My my parents never play. Ah. Uh, Actually, dude, one time a year, it was like a special event that my dad would get his colonoscopy and he'd have to like, uh, like fast for like 24 mm-hmm. hours before and then after he was hurting and he would play Rad Racer with me really? on the original Nintendo, right? Rad yeah. Racer? Yeah. Yeah. Something and that was like the one like video game. Bar what is that? Like. It was like a racing game, like, like 2D, like uh, it was dope. It was fun. Yeah. The only game my dad ever played with us was Rock Band. Oh yeah. When we had the whole band, the, my, the guitar, the, the guitar, and the drums. that was the one with the drums and the singing and stuff. And my dad was in a band. Oh yeah, he played <laughs> bass. Right? He played bass. He played guitar too. He played. Yeah. He played everything. But he was his singer too. You ever play an instrument? No. Nothing. Yeah, I'm not very. I'm not instrumentally. I'm uh, not like. Uh, I shouldn't say mentally coordinated, but I'm not. I, it just doesn't work for me. Yeah. You. But you. You freestyle, right? If I'm drunk. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So we pop, we pop Watch, you, after this, let's go. Let's go have a couple of drinks and uh, we we'll figure it out. Throw on some beats, baby. <laughs> I, I'm dead ass. <laughs> I'm down. All right, I would love that. We can like sneak record. All right, well then we gotta wrap this up real quick. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Get to the next next topic. Next Man, topic. Yeah. Ep- episode five freestyle. <laughs> freestyle. Oh, that yeah, that's gonna come at some point. <laughs> yeah, at some uh, point. prepare yourself. Yeah, it is yeah. gonna come. Oh, we, it is gonna come. One hundred percent. All of a sudden, the beat's gonna come on. Yeah, right? randomly in the middle of something, the lights are gonna <laughs> drop. You know, it's crazy. So, um, I forget what year this was, but I was still playing for the Packers. Um, our agent, uh, our agent, uh, set up this tour at um, the studio in Atlanta called Tree Sound, and so uh, they pretty much like to make a long story short, they tour you. And like tell you about who was in what room and like who sung what song, like you know all of this mm-hmm. stuff. And um, in the background, like there's this like subtle beat, like just just playing like on a loop. Yeah. But you're not really paying attention to that part, right? Like you just, I mean, you hear it, but you like, yeah. You in the studio, so like music is just on. Mm-hmm. So um, we get through the tour and like everybody's sitting down eating before we leave, and uh, these people come out and they start handing out uh pencils and paper. So everybody's like. What's going on? And like, you can't leave until you say a verse on this song. So like, everybody has that <laughs> that fucking reaction, especially me. I'm like, like, what you mean? So like, literally, they turn the beat up. So like, now you can actually hear the beat. Yeah. So like, everybody's like trying to figure out like what to say to this thing, and they put all of us in the studio like two to three <laughs> at a time. And everybody like just said like whatever they wrote down, and then they made it into this one big song. No way. Yeah. <laughs> How many and, of you were there? How many of you were there? Uh, it's probably like I don't know. Let's say between like fifteen and twenty. Oh, so that's yeah, a fair amount of people. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. That's dope. And so, and like the agents too. The agents, like everybody who was not from, like who did not work in that studio. That's yeah. actually that's a smart idea for the studio. Like, that's dope. Yeah. It was like in order to leave, you have to. And I was like, holy crap. Mine, unfortunately, was full of curse words, so I kind of got the easy part. It actually sounded cool, but uh, so crazy. I was like shitting bricks, basically. Have you ever thought? Cool. Have you ever thought about like trying to like you know, just in your free time, just like start putting out a couple songs, do an album? Oh no! Like nah. Have you have you actually? Actually, I, I thought about. It. I was going to yeah. call it a uh, blackout bars. I like, I like I a like bunch that. of random freestyles of my own self that yeah. my friends send me, and I'm yeah. like, "What?" Yeah, was and I listen to a drunk, and I'm like, "Ah, right, that was cool." Yeah. <laughs> That's dope. All right, we'll do that. Because Pac-Man, I mean, voice? we got the booth right there. The studio right is there. right behind you. Yeah, there's a booth in there, and then the mic booth is right in yeah. there. Yeah. yeah. How close do y'all stay around here? I'm I'm right down the street. I'm, I'm like kind of far yeah, away. Yeah, I'm farther away. Yeah. 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 So yeah, he's here all the time. You, yeah, I was about to say one night. I'm, I'm here every. Be, I'm here. I'm, I'm just be lit. You know? Yeah. Like, yeah. Yo, what you doing? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's get a beat. Let's get a beat in. Yeah, dude. I'm I'm here every day. Yeah. I was here till one a.m. last night making a track with a homie. Oh snap. Yeah, we'll get down. Yeah. Yeah. Pac-Man I'm, Jones I'm just dropped his first. Uh, I'm hi- I'm actually hyped like tonight to, to to get some freestyles going. Oh, you re- oh you really want to do it? I'm down, bro. Holy Don't shit. Don't tempt him with a good time. Yeah. Right? That's, <laughs> right? That's like his yeah, I like, thought it was going to be like, maybe later, maybe <laughs> another time. No, bro. You just lit the fire, right? right. I'm ready. Uh, 
Yeah. All right, we'll think, figure we'll it out. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. We'll get through this and we'll figure it out. If I get a couple drinks in me, yeah. it's funny. Yo, we're, so we're, we're brand new to this, man. Episode two. Mm -hmm. We're just figuring out as we go. We're going to have fun with it. I, I like, you know, the idea of having some segments as we roll. And I want to close out. Uh, I kind of came up with, uh, you know, some 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 of the biggest news stories in the world right now. <laughs> okay. I just want to hit a couple of these. Okay. And and just Get vibe the on these. Yeah. So this first one is one of the biggest ones in the world right now. Uh, a Kansas couple was charged with collecting a man's retirement while keeping his body in their home for six years. What? They fraudulently collected more than $215,000 in retirement benefits on behalf of a dead relative while they concealed <laughs> his body inside their home for six years. Where'd bro. they conceal it? Literally. In the basement. And their uh, other relative found it mummified downstairs on a bed. So it like just never smelled? No, it definitely or like they, did, they didn't have no visitors, I'm assuming? Yeah, they lived with that. Dude, it, and that, dude, no that, that body could, again... It smelled so bad, I'm sure. That's that, what I'm like, saying. Deathly. Yeah. I'm well, literally. Death. <laughs> <laughs> deathly. <laughs> no, no pun intended. Yeah, no pun intended. Literally. Literally. Straight up. What the? They 250, yeah. 215,000. They cashed in on it. it. But now, guess what? They're locked they, up. They didn't cash in no more. Right. <laughs> they're supposed to take that and get out the country. IRS, right? Up. Get I, out of here. IRS is coming after you real quick. Right, this is not only you screw that. That's How do you wild. think that's going to end up? That's, I that think that's just tough. So what they <laughs> like, did at the end, that's God. <laughs> what they did at the end was say, oh, uh, our relative just passed. But then they look, they did an autopsy. This guy's been, been dead for six years. years. Yeah. What do you mean? Just what, what do you mean? This guy could be in the pyramids. <laughs> this, guy, <laughs> this guy's a mummy. <laughs> like, they got that before. If they had him like wrapped up in like, like cloth and stuff, like a legit, like mummy. a legit one. Yeah. Like, That's disgusting. Like he, like he could rise in a thriller video. Yeah, that, <laughs> that's, that's exactly what it is. That's exactly what it is. Oh that's my exactly gosh. what it is. That's, All right. that's that's disgusting. Yeah, that is that's foul. All right, straight that's up. So foul. foul. Let's let's you eat dinner. And you get a whiff let's, of that. Let's keep I on that. Spirit was just like y'all some. The yeah, it's, it's just that, like ghost that, person. Ghost, that yeah. ghost is coming back to haunt them forever. Yeah, for sure, he for, has to forever. Oh my gosh, yeah. that is sad. Your relative. All That's right, so on like, on the same track of uh, there's a more death, Jesus. Yeah. Oh my Police God. charge a man with killing a suburban Philly neighbor after feuding over defendant's loud snoring. Wait, a, you can hear it through the. A suburban wait. Philadelphia man is accused of stabbing to death a neighbor with whom he had feuded after an argument about the accused man's loud snoring that could be heard through a wall connecting their homes. So it's a shared wall, probably. Not like a split. This man killed his neighbor just because he was For snoring. Snore. Like. People are messed up. Man. Yeah. I mean, people value their sleep, though. I would love to know how loud that. <laughs> that's what I mean. That's what I want to know too, because that's got to be. Or loud. how thin the walls were. Yeah, but there ain't no walls that thin for. It when it's a, yeah, they. Had, I never can hear. Yeah, you really can't hear much when it's a shared wall. But maybe there was older, and maybe you could. But maybe he was schizo. Maybe, but, but that's the first time he ever did something like that. Probably not. Guys got gotta have a loose temper. <laughs> oh, they're probably they're uncovering the, all the. I mean, that's why. What? That, that, somebody from snoring, and he died in his sleep. He must have really, uh, like again, he must have really snored loud. Like <laughs> sleep after, sleep after like, the death. <laughs> 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 Another pun. There you go. <laughs> That's, are, we, are we supposed to like fashion? Yeah, no, we're not. That's the that's the terrible thing. That's why I didn't know you were going to be bringing death into this. Right. These, are the, I mean, these are the biggest news stories in the world right now. Yeah. So ride passengers rescued after dangling upside down oh. 75 feet up for half an hour. Oh, my uh, God. A Canadian amusement park ride turned into nightmare fuel on Sunday after stopping suddenly, oh. suspending passengers upside down 70 feet above the ground for nearly 30 minutes. People were all probably passed out because you, the amount of that blood rushing to your head is... Right. Like, you have the, to, right wait, the ride stuck while it was On the loop-de-loop. -loop, yeah. What people say, on the loop-de-loop -loop or whatever. So it was yep. a loop-de-loop -loop and they got stuck like that. So they're dangling they just, upside oh. down. Yeah, for 30 minutes. Again, like... Their phones were falling yeah, like out of their pockets. passed out. They had to like pass yeah, but, out. I mean, you, you get an ab workout because again, you yeah, have to like... Hold yourself. Oh man, 
what is what is the park going to give you for that? Because it's not like you sign a and maybe when you buy the ticket, it signs a waiver that says you can't, like you know, sue them no. for, if that happens. But man, that is, I would be. You, I got season tickets for life, but I ain't never ride. But I ain't never like, ride that ride again. The whole amusement park. Do you go? Do you, do you like like rides like roller coasters? Uh, I used to when I was small. I feel like I weigh too much. Yeah, I yeah. don't trust none of those weight capacity things. I no. tried to zip line once. I was like, I'm cool on that too. <laughs> um, You're fine. I pick whatever is safe. Yeah. So like I'll do like I don't know something that like go in a circle, but it's in the same place. So you can yeah. take that though. You can take the round, round, round spinning. Yeah, I mean, like, I would rather not. Yeah. But like that's yeah, safer that's than like you something like. So you'll be like, yeah, air. you go Disney. You won't ride the roller coaster. You'll ride the teacups. This one hundred percent. Put Yo. me in there. <laughs> Yo, you're talking to Mr. Disney himself right now. <laughs> well, my you, you'll get on everything. Oh yeah. Well, I love I love roller coasters, but my fiance like loves loves Disney. So we go we like we go quite a bit. Um, but like I'll ride any roller coaster. Like I've ridden some of the best in the world, like at Cedar Point in Ohio, which has got like three of the top five roller coasters, like zero to one twenty five in like two seconds Dang. like straight up i love that oh i love Hell that no. i love that that's beast <laughs> Maybe if i'm screaming like i the whole time yeah I, false courage yeah. i might yeah but by the time i yeah. get off i'll be sober and be like i'm ready to go yeah. I, but don't yeah. get me wrong like i mean i i'm screaming on that baby like i yeah. let i let it out i let it out yeah <laughs> That's my thing is I'm like, ah, yeah, baby, yeah, baby, yeah. That's all. That's what I'm I think I would about. like. I haven't, I haven't done a uh, amusement park in so long, but I think, I think I would. Enjoy I love that. roller coasters. Yeah. I love that thrill. Mm -hmm. I, yeah. I, I don't, I don't love. I'll do them, but I don't love the free falls where you like they just take you like straight up. Yeah, and then no, you I'm just good like, on that. Whoosh. So me and a friend of mine, we was uh, me, him, and a uh, girl that he, his girlfriend. I was gonna say a girl he talks to, but his girlfriend. Uh, we was lit at the crib after like being out for one night. And uh, we YouTubed, um, I don't know what you would call it, but uh, roller coaster rides were like a, like a slingshot where they just shoot you in the air. Oh, yeah. But yeah, then yeah. like the people like just pass out. Oh, yeah, yeah. So we like watched <laughs> yeah. that for like yeah. 45 minutes straight, just like lit. And I'm like, that is hilarious, but it probably would be me. Those I haven't done, the actual where you're like in the little ball thing, like strapped in and it literally just like, and like sends you up. Yeah. I've never actually done one of those. And that one... I'm iffy on that one. <laughs> and I like the, I like going fast, yeah. and I don't mind like the drops and the roller coaster yeah. and stuff. But yeah, this that like I've because I've seen those too where people are like, <laughs> and then they just they just they <laughs> yeah. just like, like yeah. literally literally <laughs> oranges <laughs> lip, lip body lip body yeah, lip body like, and they come back to life and they're like ah! yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like I don't I don't want no parts of that how is that how is that enjoyable it's yeah. not yeah. no I'm good I, that one I'm alright have on. you ever been skydiving no but I do want to go skydiving actually. I go? will go indoor skydiving it's right down there by Tom yeah, yeah yeah oh yeah I'm down to but do you that. you haven't jumped out of a plane ever I, I haven't either so I'm I don't not, even I'm like, like being on planes I'm, no, you don't like planes. No. Yeah, but guess no. what? If that thing goes down, you got a parachute trapped on your back. You're good. If you go skydiving. Yeah, yeah I was about to say. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I was about to say, what not, part of not, I, not, I heard not, a couple not, of yeah. stories get me the, the whole yeah. talk before the flight take off. Yeah. Well, my parachute like, been this whole yeah. time. What airline are you on? Yeah, which, to be fair, I didn't have a I parachute. Once. Why they don't like even <laughs> like I'd rather have the opportunity, even if I never parachuted, it's like, yo, this plane is screwed. Here's parachutes, guys. Like you're probably gonna go down like, anyway. Instead so of giving me, me a floaty, yeah. instead of giving me a floaty, yeah. Like just give me G a parachute. Give me a chance at least. Yeah. At least you got a chance. Because I can't swim yeah. anyway. So no matter, <laughs> yeah. even if we land in water, like that's we my worst nightmare. Like that. Literally worst nightmare. Drowning? No, not oh. drowning necessarily, but crash in ocean or being stranded in the ocean. Like yeah, that is that my biggest. I think that's my biggest fear. I, that's yeah. why, like, I wouldn't go down. Like with the submarine thing that happened, whatever, a couple months ago and stuff. Like I wouldn't go. I would go. I would go. I'd go to space on yeah. a rocket ship. Same. I wouldn't go down in a submarine like that unless it was like a military submarine or like James Cameron made it. He makes good submarine. Yeah. Um, but but yeah, I'm but good on that. I, I'm yeah. I, the bottom of the ocean. That water. I, I I'll go in any. Like I I'm not afraid of the ocean or anything. But again, like a plane crash in the in the ocean. Worst nightmare. And you survive. Worst, and you worst. Just float in every, everything. Yeah, in everything. In the middle of nowhere. Worst, worst nightmare. There's literally nowhere to go. Even if you can swim, there's nowhere to go. And yeah. you don't know what's below you. 
You feel me? No. That's that's the, see the ocean. I love the ocean. Yeah, I like. It I too. love surfing. Yeah. I mean, my stealing oceans. That's yeah. what I go True. by. <laughs> True. Yeah, I love it. But the idea of being in the middle of the ocean. Yeah, with nothing. Yeah. Yes. And just not, not knowing what's below you. But and I think like again that especially. But again, like knowing that like again like there's a plane and then you got to worry about that thing sinking below you. Like everything, just that whole thing. Yeah. I, I I try to knock myself out pretty hard whenever I fly over the ocean. But I, I don't, I'm I pretty like sure. That. I'm pretty sure I'll die from having an asthma attack before we get anywhere. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm I mean, out of there. Sense. Like, yeah. I, yeah. I don't need a parachute yeah. or a floating. Yeah. Like, I, I'm out of there. I'm good. Peace yeah. out. I'm gone. Like, I'm, I'm gone. I can't breathe. Uh, no, I'm <laughs> but I would much rather go to space. Me too. Then, yeah. Yeah, I was going to ask, would you, if, you, yeah, I would if, go to space. if Elon or uh, what was his name, blonde Jeff hair? Bezos. Oh, or Bezos. Uh, Branson. Or Branson hit you up and was like, hey, you want to come to space? Would you go? I, I'll go. Yeah, I'd, I'd go take that trip. I'd go too. I would go too. Yeah. I used to have a really bad fear of death like seven years ago. Uh, like I just kind of like dove into the idea of death and it scared the shit out of me. But then once I started to research space and like really dove deep into it and I started to think about how small we are on this Compared earth. Compared to like everything yeah. else yeah. out there. That just kind of calmed me, man. Just knowing like, yeah, I'm just lucky to be here. We're good. But yeah, if I had a chance... To go up to but space, think about the know. concept of going to space. You're in a a rocket ship. Yeah, that it's a giant gas whatever booster that's sending you like ten thousand miles per hour up, bro. That was all, the coolest thing I ever saw. It was so dope. The coolest thing I ever saw. This guy had to have felt so good about this one liner. It was when e Elon had done his first the first test. Of sending people up yeah. with SpaceX, yeah, um, and there was two fighter pilots um, that were like Navy test pilots, so you know they, they they're good in like pressure situations and mm -hmm. stuff. But literally, as they were taking off, he goes, "Let's light this candle up." And then they, they took, he called his rocket a candle. <laughs> yeah, that's just what he said. He said, "Like, <laughs> like let's light this candle." He was hyped. That was that's what yeah. I'm saying. That was that he could not have played that one liner <laughs> better. I was like. Yes, let's go, let's go. He got hype with it. I did, I literally, got hype with literally, it. I get yeah. goosebumps thinking about it. I just, like, I just imagine myself sitting there, I'm just like, oh, God. Oh, my goodness. Let's light this candle up. So if you, have, if you have Bezos, you have an invitation from Bezos, you have an invitation from Elon, you have an invitation from, who's the guy? I keep Richard from, Branson. Branson, who I've actually met before. Oh, really? Stay, uh, yeah. yeah, when we played this uh, festival in the Caribbean, it was dope. Uh, which invitation would you take? Elon, not even questioned. Yeah, you know I'm going with him because he know what he's talking about. <laughs> yeah, well, me first. I don't know nothing about. I all do. Three I've, of them. I've studied all of theirs. The, the 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 reason why I would go with Elon is he's the only person, or his company SpaceX is the only company that's landed a rocket that's gone into space. They brought that rocket back into atmosphere and landed it. Yeah, that's the newest one, which hasn't had people on it yet. No, it hasn't yeah, had people yeah. on but, it. But but, but well, I mean, his rockets. That's why his rocket. That's why his program yeah. because his rockets, the boosters, literally detach and then land on platforms by themselves. <laughs> yeah. But Elon's the only one. Yeah. Elon's the only one that's actually made it to like the International Space Station. Like uh, Jeff Bezos's goes into I don't know what it's called, but just above the atmosphere, so you can get to zero g for a second. Zero g. But yeah. then comes down. Branson's a plane that goes up and like it's you more get of a zero plane. g. Yeah, yeah. You still though. go up. Yeah, yeah. But but. but Elon will send you to the damn he, he, moon. He'll get you where you need to go. <laughs> He'll send you to the moon. Oh, we got to get the pod popping off so we can get the invite. Yeah. That'd be cool to shoot we a live roll. pod too while you're like strapped in. Like, let's put that. Yeah, let's put that on a docket. <laughs> First live pod from space. That'd be cool. That would be cool. I'm down. That would be cool. That's oh, I'd be the first dreadhead in space. That, I'm on. Wow. Yeah, that would be cool. Dope. All right, we're breaking. A, that, honestly, yeah, you have to tie your dreads down. You have zero G. Your dreads will be like. Like, just, like just, you, right? yeah. that'd be cool yeah. dude because soon he's gonna get to the moon throwing the first football on the moon because it won't hurt your arm either you low grat like low but, like would a football come down it has to have a little weight to it i'm pretty sure okay, but, right. but yeah. i think i think it could that'd be cool yeah First football game on the moon. See football, somebody moon cleats. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you see someone flying out of nowhere. You call that a, you know, the big hits back in the day. You see a... <laughs> Slow-mo. But again, that's the one scary thing. On the moon, there's some gravity, so you won't float away. But that's the one thing. I mean, anything happens in space, you're screwed. And if yeah, you, like, and what if you, if you float away? Like, Oh, you're done. See ya. 
That's kind of a dope way to go. Sayonara. Uh, literally, literally. That's literally. the thing, though. Yeah. It's, yeah, it's and like, you could sit like that, too. Yeah, yeah. There's nothing yeah. else you can do. Yeah. 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 yeah I, I, do some shit from Ricky. You got, a, yeah, you got a good view. <laughs> you, do. you do go out it's with a good the, view. the best view possible. It's a good way to go, man. Yeah. And you're alone, like in your peace. Yeah, that would still stink. But yeah, again, I'd rather yeah. go. I'd rather. That's a slow day. I'd rather go out like that, though. That yeah. all the people say drowning is like people who have drowned and been revived say like it's a very peaceful experience. Really, I think I'd rather if I'm dying. If I'm dying, no matter what, you, you made this very morbid. Now it's just all about death. So thank you. Um, but I would rather. See, he years. just put that on me. He's I the mean, one who's talking about how he wants to die. In now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> in Charmin toilet tissue. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and single ply too they didn't have the respect to get him double ply you feel me yeah. the thin shit where your fingers go through yeah yeah literally <laughs> airport tissue literally 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 literally, literally. Oh but yeah no gosh. I'd rather I'd rather oh. float off in space that's a cooler death than drowning S- send me off baby. yeah send me off that, yeah that'd be dope yeah I'm down for that yeah well I feel good about this yeah. you guys feel good about this I'm uh, solid yeah, I'm episode two great. closed episode two closed episode three yeah. so maybe next week yeah we'll either figure out Horse, or we'll do Madden to start it off. We'll do horse. See, he ready for those five shots. That's no, all no the, the problem with him is you actually like he's gonna go to the the gym now. Yeah, every five day. shots. H O R S E. Glad you could spell for horse. you. That's lobster and beer with Eddie Lacy. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Peace.